Bro, I can't stand this nigga. Learn a little something. Take a lesson. Learn it all. Welcome back, guys. We are taking on Icarus once again. We are on the second node. This time we're going on the right-hand side. And so here's our team. This is my second run at this. So uh, we've got Mo Man. We know Mo Man don't care. We've got Doom on the on the team, and we've got Kingpin with Mr. Sinister for those belly bounces. And with Icarus, I can't think of anyone better in my roster than Red Guardian. Let's go. Okay, so Mo Man don't care. Basically, we're going to build up. Uh, as many of those Furies as we can, and as soon as that D-Gen comes in, it's gonna be coming in as a debuff, and we all know what happens with debuffs in Mole Man, he just shrugs them off. Uh, at the same time, he's building up that monster mass, and uh, building up a lot of attack damage, so here we go, there's an SP2, bam bam, Mole Man don't care. Alright, next up we've got Mole Man up against Hulk, going down this line here on the right hand side. Uh, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to build up all of those Furies. We're not even going to worry about anything. No knockdowns, none of that. Uh, as you can see, those debuffs aren't hanging around because, well, as you guessed it, Mo Man don't care. Here he comes. As soon as we get to that SP2, it's going to be lights out. But uh, I didn't use the SP2 because Mo Man don't care. <laughs> oh, a word? You, you got auto block? <laughs> Mo Man don't care. <laughs> All right, so here we go, going up against uh, Modok here. Uh, we're just going with the same, the same uh, tactics here, launching that SP1, bam. And it was guaranteed crit, so we're gonna bait out his SP1, go on in. Now he did get a chance to auto block there because I was uh, over the monster mass uh, amount, but uh, didn't matter because we we bled him out and shocked him out, and he's gone. Okay, now we are on to Fire Boy here. All right, throwing out a little bit of shock. It's not quite monster mass shock, but uh, that's okay because uh, small man don't care. There we go, taking on that human torch. He is out of here. Get out of here. All right, next one. We have Doctor Strange here, but guess what? Mo man don't care. Uh, but technically, Mo Man should care because every time he gains one of these Furies, uh, he's being nullified by Doc Strange. Uh, so he's not really getting a chance to build up the kind of damage that we want here. So uh, this is definitely going to be one of the longer fights. But that's okay. Mo Man still don't care. taking out that Doctor Strange SP2 like it's nothing. So the strategy I'm trying to use here is trying to build up as many Furies as possible and launching the SP1 while I have that damage. Because uh, I'm not going to be able to keep it for very long to get to the SP2. Look at that. Look at that. Shooting blanks. Shooting blanks there. So I was able to activate Frenzy there because he was able to tap me in there, so that at least I'm getting some guaranteed crits. Got him on that stand-up intercept and finished with the combo. That is done. Moment straight up did not care. Alright, we got some skill-on-skill uh, -skill violence going on here uh, with Crossbones. Yeah, he didn't follow up with the backdraft intercept. But there we go, we get the front face intercept. Caught a claw to the grill. And not the kind that you can take a sip on. I don't even know where this is going. But here we go. Going in with the five hit combo. Bam. Hitting them with that shock damage. Ba bam. Alright, here come the frenzy. Yeah, right. Guaranteed crits are nice when you're doing that damage. Here comes the slap. Uh, 15k. Right in the face. KO. Alright, here we go. Alright, so we're choosing somebody different here uh, for this fight. Uh, what I'd like to do is uh, lock our Symbiote Supreme in the corner uh, as soon as I can. Because he doesn't gain power all that fast, at least not at first. So you can just go ham and hope that he doesn't... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Neutralize all of your unstoppable, but there we go. Bam, going. Hit that, that SP2. Boom. And now you've got yourself a nice, long-lasting... Unstoppable, but, uh, yeah. 
does, doesn't really last that long against him. <laughs> but we can still hit him with the belly bounce. And we're done. Okay, it took a lot less damage than I was expecting in that fight. Okay, here we have another Mo Man doesn't care. Or Mo, no, actually, I'm sorry. Mo Man don't care. Okay, Green Goblin. Uh, never my favorite fight. I really hate his SP2. Um, even though I made the tutorial for his SP2, it can still catch you. It's just to make you more aware. But you already know what's going to happen. Because I spoiled it. Yeah. Okay, so basically I backed up, I tried to do the double back trick, and uh, I tried to dex real quick, but it, uh, you know, I don't know. Maybe I was too late, or maybe it didn't work, or whatever. Anyway, uh, I get a second chance here. Now the great thing here with, uh, with Red Guardian is all those Furies that should be on you aren't on you, and you're just rebuilding up your durability. So now we got a max durability right there. Mmm, taking no kind of damage. Bam! For maximum damage for that SP2. Take those two heavies to the grill. Bam. With the re-parry. Full-on combo. Going for a rematch on the SP2. What you got, son? I'm tired of you. Okay, so watch here. This is how we do it. Montel Jordan style. You gotta do the double back. And when you get to double back, you're immediately ready for your next dex because you know it's coming just like that that's how it was supposed to happen but it didn't thank you very much red guardian for rebuilding the name comes to sp2 for the finish mm. Well, the heavies for the finish. It's more of the heavies, but it would have been more impressive if it happened on the SP2. Okay, here we have a, a rematch here against Omega Red. Uh, we didn't do that great on the first run, but uh, I think I got this one pretty down. Uh, we're going to just uh, utilize our ability to heavy attack uh, to keep all of the uh, the degens down. I right, got that intercept, bam. All right, now we're in a good place to power rotate him. So all we have to do is just go in, get our heavy attacks, and we're always going to be in a good spot to bait the SP-1. So I go with the SP2. Now, this is something that has uh, has bitten me uh, in future episodes uh, because he goes turtle after I do the SP2 and just kind of basically waits out those Furies to expire and then I get a ton of degen damage. So uh, that was a lucky run right there. I was able to kind of get that intercept because he happened to be aggressive. But definitely uh, not suggested. Play the safe route. Here we go. We did it again. Okay, gotta rush right in. Bam. I mean, it works really great if they're aggressive. If they're not aggressive, uh, that's not gonna be a good day for you. And you can't really afford to find out. Got another SP1 bait. Uh, we're gonna go in and uh, I'm not going to launch the SP2 this time. I'm um, not sure why I didn't do it in my thought process. Probably I was staring at my 100% health bar. Anyway, launch the SP2 right here. 
And there it is. That's the thing I was worried about. So I was able to get an intercept, but I didn't, I didn't, uh, I, I didn't capitalize on it. Uh, and I started taking the degen damage. That's exactly what I was afraid of. And uh, now I've pushed him to SP2 because I panicked. So just for the future, don't do it. Don't do it. Man, it used to be yellow, and now it's red. Had a full, full, full health bar. Bam! You think I'm gonna do that again? Nah, son. Going for SP3 this time. Just wanted to bait out that SP1 just to make sure I wasn't taking any chances. We got a little bit of 12%. Didn't need to be perfect. Pretty sure I got more than enough here. And we're done. Anyway, if you liked the video and you want to see more, go ahead and click subscribe, like, comment, and share it with your friends. Share it with your mama. All that stuff helps me out. And remember, stay dorky. And I'll catch y'all on the flip. Oh. Promise. Learn a little something. Take a lesson. Learn it all.